Morning one and all. Okay, got my 100k in today. I uh, told you Sunday, I told you I'd get 100k in today. One way or the other. So it didn't rain. I thought it was going to rain. But it didn't. It's been beautiful weather. And um, well happy with that. So I did about 110, I think. Let me have a quick look. Um, yeah, 110 k's. Um, nice and steady. 195 average power. Um, 120 average heart rate. So nothing major. Um didn't break any records, anything like that, just went for a nice cruise around. But what I did was, I was meeting one of my mates out at the top of um, Summit and meeting him at six, but I went out at five. Okay, so I did a quick 30 before I met him, and um, then I did 50 with him, and then I finished off about another 20 odd on my own. So sometimes you want to get a bit of training in, well, that's what you just got to do, haven't you? Go out a bit earlier or stay out a bit longer when everyone else is going in but anyway it was a good old ride i was well happy with that it's either that or get on the indoor trainer and i didn't really fancy doing 100 k's on the indoor trainer although on zwift i see heaps of people they're up doing like 160 170 k's on the trailer don't know how the hell they do it but anyway um just got back had a big bowl of porridge my usual you know cinnamon all the rest of it before I left, I had a little bowl of porridge um, with some cinnamon and stuff in it. Uh, banana. Uh, on the ride, I had another banana, um, an SIS gel, an SIS um, energy bar, and um, a couple of bottles of water. Uh, that is it. So stay well and truly hydrated for the rest of the time. I'll be eating a fair bit because let me have a look. What did I burn today? Let me just have a quick butcher's hook. 2,555 calories, so that's pretty good. I can eat a fair bit today. I can get sort of food stuck into me. I've got to go down now. This is only a quick video. I've got to nip down now to my mother-in-law's and finish off a fence um, that I did about two weeks ago for us. So I've got one panel to put in. Uh, but before I do, part of this video is I've got some great video footage as well, and um, I'll be sticking that on later on today. Um, so keep your eye open for that. But this is my favourite item of clothing for riding in the cold. All right? It's this thing. It's called a snoot. Straight through like that. And it's awesome. So I had this on all the ride. I had it on today. And it keeps your head nice and warm, your neck, your ears. You can have it however you like. So I'll show you how it goes. Now some say that's an improvement. But, um, you know, that's everyone's opinion varies. So look at this look still round your neck goes round your head like this so it covers the front of your head as well which is great stops the wind hitting it keep your ears nice and warm your neck all the rest of it or you can pull it up a bit and have it as a bit of a balaclava you can pull the whole thing back a bit obviously your your hat goes on your head as well you can have it like that or you can just drop it down if you're doing a bit of a burst pushing out some power and you want to get some serious oxygen into you just pull that down and it goes or if it gets too hot just pull it down and you've got it as a nice scarf it keeps you so warm it's unbelievable i tell you i recommend anyone to get one of these it's not very thick it's not very thick at all it's real light but it's just amazing how warm it keeps you so anyway useless information for a sunday for you just thought i'd throw that one in there keep your eye open for some of my videos they will be coming up shortly when I get back from fixing this fence and I've edited them and put a few bits and pieces on I'll get them out there for you so until then see you then got any questions or comments you know what to do